How exactly is it a vacuum? Very nice. That's a really good question. Right. Okay. Good so question. when I was a kid, a vacuum was a physical object. Yes, it was. When I heard physicists speak of the vacuum of space, I just imagine all these hoovers you right. know, in, in the sky. Right. So I didn't know that a vacuum was a thing, was it was an it was a concept, and then you make a machine that duplicates that thing. I just didn't know that until I learned. Okay. So a vacuum is where there's basically no air. Okay. You can have objects there. But when we think of a vacuum, it's not a place where there isn't anything. It's a place where there's no air molecules moving, mm. typically. Mm -hmm. All right. Generally, you can have some, and we would still classify it as a vacuum. Because you have to distinguish like a regular old vacuum or a perfect vacuum. Right. Now, you know what happens if there's an object and you take away all the air molecules? The object outgasses. Oh. There are air molecules embedded Inside? in the surface of that object, and they start coming out. It's fascinating. Then you heat it, it sends out more. Mm. So it's very hard to make a perfect vacuum. Very hard. So here's an old saying. Nature abhors, abhors a, vacuum. a vacuum. These are people who have never been into space. Most of the universe is a vacuum. Nature loves a vacuum. Nice. The point is, when there's a source of gravity, all the air wants to go to that source of gravity, and it leaves... A vacuum everywhere else. So a vacuum is simply where there's no air, and it's not anything deep. 